Hey everybody, Buff Cheese here. Welcome to my Let's Play of Crusader Kings 2. I'm playing as Hasten of Nantes, intending to become the Norman King of Sicily. Now, quite conveniently, I had a very early conversion to Norman in Lyon, so I moved my capital there, and then culture shifted to Norman, so I'm now Norman. So that's the first objective finished, way before I expected it to be. So now, I'm sort of debating whether I want to go down here, and take over a couple of these little places, which I could do because I can conquest any single county and they're all small counties. So I might as well. Is that, are they currently at war with... Uh, they are not. Okay. I would have thought there'd be a... They normally uh, try and invade... Thing. Okay, they did. Cool. Normally the Byzantines immediately take it back. But that's fine. Um... So yeah, I'm already Norman. I might as well start going Mediterranean style and declare a conquest war on there. But I mean, how many troops does this guy have? Because I can just stick my guys on a fleet. 902, 962 rather. Him is 822. Stick my guys on a fleet and then turn up there, but I don't currently have enough to completely overwhelm him, so I will just have to Okay, the Horus suffer in this life. He has been imprisoned. This is something I quite like as uh, playing as Germanic, not Norse anymore. We're Germanic. Um, is they send people to try and convert you, and it's free money because you just go. Ah, actually, I don't really like that. And then you take, you just imprison them, and then you sell them back for money. It's great. So I am going to have Cagliari as a base of operations because why not, really? Um, and then it spreads out my holdings. Instead of being holy ward out of the Mediterranean by one holy ward, I'll have one there, and then one in Capua, and then one in Salerno. So it spreads it out a little bit. So I've declared war. As far as I know, he has no allies. I probably should have checked. All my troops can go here. The fleet can meet them there. I think it's under 4,000. Probably not. Cool, he is turned up again, and he is being ransomed again. Different guy, but point still stands. Stop sending your people. Fleet levies, I'm going to raise my vassal fleets as well. Because I don't want to spend the money. And they'll hate me, but it doesn't really matter, so it's fine. Uh, embark. And just turn up there. This is... Like, uh, this is per I love the Vikings, just for this reason. It's just... You know what? I want this bit of land. Oh, Breton revolt. They want to restore the kingdom of Brittany. Oh, God, that's a large army. Okay, cool. Um, I'm gonna win this war. Because if I lose this war up here, I will have no land. Because they can occupy uh, other territory as well. So, if I can avoid that... Kind. Oh, this is... Everything was going well last episode. Now everything's looking like it's not going to go particularly well this time. Okay, I've crushed his army. Uh, who are you? You know what? You are a much better marshal. I don't care if he's upset. You can train troops in Leon. So what if I... Once I've won this war, I think that I've got another son. Osborne, Osborne. Uh, yes, I've got another son. Oh, he's more valuable. Lovely. I'll get seventy gold for him. See, I can I can fund mercenary companies just by selling off the priests. So it's fine. So yeah, so I'll win this war as quick as I can. Get back, get back up here. He's they're losing troops to uh, sieging. So I'm if they get through a lot, I might not even have to hire mercenaries. Because Ragnar is leading this. Not Ragnar. Haston is reading this. Is leading these forces. So he's actually really good. So I might not need... Okay, I've got another son to be educated. Uh, yep. You can have both my sons under your tutelage. Yep, that's fair enough. He's Norman. It doesn't really matter to me at the moment uh, what his other stats are. What am I doing? I want to I wanna educate my own people. Especially my primary heir. That was... Why did I do that? Yeah, definitely want to educate my own heir. 
So yes, I will win this war, get this land. And give these out. Oh yes, and I can you can now found kingdom in in, in there. You can now found kingdoms in Charlemagne. I couldn't speak them for a second. Uh I, f I don't know if it's just if you buy the DLC or if it's just a, a free update, but it is pretty great. But as it happens, I don't know if I'll actually do that. I might do. We'll find out. So yes, uh, I've won this war. I have quite a bit more than I was wanting. I'm going to invite a noble called, what's his, Nigel was this one? Someone was Nigel. I don't know. He's Norman and also content. So you can have more Tain. Because I want to keep this land down here for myself. So, send this fleet back. Drop them off in Lyon. Another bishop of the papacy. The Pope has sent his own man. And his own man has been imprisoned. Oh, I meant to do a great blot. That's what I was meant to do. Oh, well. That was last episode. I, get, I, get, I forget otherwise. So... I can drop those fleets. Because the wonderful thing about uh, Tiggers, no, uh, German Germanics now, I suppose, is that you can still raise your levies without them being annoyed. Which I think is pretty great. Now, what are most of these? Oh, yes, they're a liberation revolt. So they're actually good armies, not just peasant armies. So for this, I don't want to take any chances. And I'm going to hire... I'm going to get a good numbers advantage. Wait for them to morale up. There is no... Is there a river? There isn't a river. So I should just be able to march straight in and kill them all. Which I've just done. Well, not all of them. I'm about to kill all of them. All of them are, all of them are about to die. Oh! I died a natural death? Oh, that's shit! I should have been in battle! That would have been so much better. Cool. So, my vassals... I am i wasn't ready for a secession war, honestly. But, actually, no, this is perfect. This is perfect timing. If I win this war, I'll get the bonus two relations for crushing a major revolt. So, that is great. You're going to Anju? Get out of Anju. So, they all hate me at the moment, I'm pretty sure. Well, no. My councillors hate me, but they're all... Chief of Van... Envious? You're envious. Come on. Come on, man. You're the only one who wasn't content. I let you pass because you were just and you were great. Don't make me regret that decision. I've crushed them. I gained prestige, which is brilliant for a eight-year-old ruler. I've just crushed a revolt. That means... Uh... Oh, okay. I suppose that doesn't count towards uh... crushing a major revolt if it's actually a liberation revolt. It might just need to be a vassal revolt. Either way, I'm losing a lot of money, so I'm going to disband that mercenary company. And disband those levies. So I'm going to have kept the event troops. That's interesting. Anyway, yes. So, that is done. I need to be educated by someone. Uh, Nigel. Yeah, you know what, Nigel? You can continue to teach me. You're pretty great. Uh, so, yes, I am now Norman. And they are slowly becoming Norman, which is good. What were they? It was Norse. Why does he start out Norse? Whatever. Anyway. I want to carry on going down into the Mediterranean, I think. Although, Ireland is looking pretty tasty. Does he have any allies? He has no allies. How many troops does he have? None, essentially. Oh, God. Cool. I say let's go for it. I have troops to spend. What's the worst that can happen? I can lose the war? Oh no. Oh yeah, so I lost my uh, event fleets and I lost my... My vassals don't seem to have anywhere near as much thing. I wonder if that's part of the tribal mechanics. But they're not tribal. So I don't know. Maybe it's, it is due to prestige still. Maybe it could be. Oh, that's not enough people. Okay. So I'll make a new unit of people until they are... Do I still have a mercenary company? I don't. Okay. I wonder what the Breton company was. A thousand odd 
drop them off in there so they don't take the morale hit straight away. Get them in there. Take them over here. My prisoner is complaining. I don't care. Once I've actually won this, I'll do this to get... I've become shy. Please, please, educator, get rid of that. He's deciding not to. He doesn't want to. So fair enough, I'm now shy. I am Ragnar of Brittany the Shy. Taking this army out quite quickly and easily. Just completely wipe him out. Let him rot. And go back over here. Right. So this is a good little uh, boost to prestige. It'll give me some prisoners for a blot. Which I want to do before I go down into the... What I imagine will be more difficult region of Sicily. Italy region. So I want the I want to be ready, basically, before I get to that stage. Now he's Midas touched. I would be quite happy to become Midas touched. Okay, I've got more levies. Yeah, I wonder why my uh, available troops dropped so low. Cool. I wonder if all these are still tribal, or if they are. No, they all become thingy. But the why do these change? They're Welsh. Oh, so all the Welsh places and Germanic places stay tribal. Okay. That's good to know. I love the new tribal mechanics. Just I, I'm currently running the uh, Republic of Man and the Isles based in Man. Um, and it's great fun. Just there's so many. It's, it makes the game so much more varied, I feel. Oh, the Muslims are trying to convert me now. I'm afraid that's not going to happen. I'll have your money though. Right, let's just wait for this siege to tick down. Should be in the next month. There we go. Cool. That's a victory. Cool. And I will spread this out as well. Oh yes, also I have brothers. I forget about the brothers. Um, <laughs> he's the chief of Cagliari. <laughs> Brilliant. Um, so yeah, he doesn't like me particularly much. He's pretty great though, and he likes me. So there is a defeated rebels thing. Why was it not showing up before? Okay. Maybe it only applies to uh, dynastic vassals. Well, that's weird. All right, so uh, I've done this now. So I'm gonna disband those levies, and I'm going to head back down to the Mediterranean. Because I want to keep on going. I mean, actually, now, because I'm a new character now, I can have another prepared invasion. I think I need a thousand prestige to actually do it, so I might end up yeah, I might, they're not, a, it's not like the Byzantines completely control the area. I should be fine just picking off the small estates first, such as Neopolis, or even Capua. But Capua, I don't want to be on a border with Italy to start with, because then they can holy war me, as far as I know. I think it is limited by uh, borders and stuff, but they have a lot of people. They have less people. I could... Mm, Amalfi? What's Amalfi like for people? Lots of people. Um, it depends if I think I can win the war. I'm gonna, I'll go for Capua, really. So I'll dump my man there. Capua, you're only a child ruler as well, so I'm not expecting too much hassle. But then again, I'm a child ruler and I'm conquering the world, so that's something. Everyone goes there. Oh, another imam shall be executed. I meant to do another blot. I didn't do a blot. Oh, woe is me. Okay, there is slightly too many people there, so I will get rid of... Uh, I need... I wish it would tell me exactly how many people there are. That'll do. That's enough people to leave behind for a return journey if I need to. 
so much sleep down here. Oh, it's if I got this, I could just continually raid the Papacy. Just be like, hello, Rome. I'm going to steal your money now. I love raiding Rome because I can't actually do anything about it because they're only a single state, single county. So if you just turn up, you land troops there. They can't raise any troops. So they can't defend you against you. It's just great. Yes, I'm going to drop my troops off in Neopolis. And yeah, I'm losing troops because I have no thing. Is that a mountain? It's hills. This could go badly. However, it has not gone badly. It's gone very well. So let's carry on. Oh my god, another Br another liberation revolt. Ugh. Come on, just accept that I'm your new overlord. Liberation revolts are, are horrible. They're worse than peasant revolts or... or Heretic revolts because they're actually decent armies. But they have split up. I'm going to let them take places if they want. Doesn't really bother me at this stage. I want to become a cook. <laughs> I want to become a cook. I become brave. Another priest to ransom. Lovely. It's really annoying whoever's sending them though. So, I'm kind of worried there's going to be a holy war coming my way. But in which case, as long as I've got enough of a hold down here, I might be able to just... I'm going to order them seized, because... reasons. Yeah, I don't really care too much. Um, oh, did they get away? I think they got away. They did get away, fair enough. He's complaining about his place down there. I thought I'd ransomed you. There we go. Have your freedom. I'll have your gold. So yes, um, yeah. As we're saying, if I if they if they holy war me up in Brittany, I can simply just convert to Catholicism, and that's fine. Oh, hello. Is this a holy war? It's a holy war. I could convert to the attacker's religion and become Catholic. I'm not going to because that's barely any men. And once I've won this war, I'm going to go and crush you, and then I'll invade you just to spite you. Bloody hell. How dare he. Who does he think he is? Oh, who just died? Someone died. Someone was murdered by rebels. Because I left them. Bloody hell, this guy... This... Oh, and I can't... okay, cool. That kind of works in my favour. If they start getting... If they start fighting each other, which they don't seem to be doing, they just seem to be sort of like, okay... We're just going to invade each other's places. Yeah, let them let them fight it out. I can't do anything about it because he's my regent and I'm only 11. You. Stop it. Stop it, you. End plot. How did she... Why did she give in? Weird. Okay, 100%. Cool. Uh, enforce demands. I get the city. I get the whole... Bloody county, that's what I get. I'm gonna give all these away. This is a great county. Lovely. Okay, send these troops back onto the ship. Send these over there. There's quite a lot of wars for this child ruler to deal with. The hills, okay, that's unfortunate. I don't really want to deal with this. Hopefully, I can just win this war and then head up there to deal with them. Why aren't they fighting? They're, they're gonna have to fight soon enough, and then that'll. Hopefully, whittle them down enough so I can just march in and clean up. Alright, I'm going to send these troops in. Crush this force. Hopefully, it is a clean kill. Good. Clean battle. At the very least, I might just crush his army and then leave. Because at the moment, I can't necessarily deal of all of these wars and wait to win this. I mean, I have vassals. But of course, all his all his troops are dead, essentially. Oh no, I raised... Why did I raise troops? I didn't need to raise troops there. Right, okay, I'm gonna recapture this castle. Where's he going? He's sending... He's going off somewhere. Whatever. 
I'm losing so many courtiers just to rebels. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna drop people in. 207 men against all those. Okay, good luck. Good luck. Just seriously, just good luck. Um, I will have to hire mercenaries, I think. But first, I want to deal with the Arborea. Arborea. I don't know how it's pronounced. I'm losing lots of men. This is bad. Stop taking my shit. I need that. I'm losing so many men just to... What? I don't even know. Okay, cool. Right, send these guys back. I'm guessing... Oh, that's a hundred odd men. That's fair enough. That's good enough. So at this stage, that's a war changing amount. That's therefore loaded. Send these guys back. Okay, if I hire mercs, where are they going to turn up? In or nearby Lyon. So they could end up being immediately wiped out. I'm going to go for... Oh, no! Good, they're not going to stop them. My plan is coming together. Ha! <laughs> and Arborea troops were just destroyed. My current regent has been changed. To this guy. Fair enough. And my guardian is still this guy, so that's fair enough. I might have waited too long. This is an er this is an issue. Heising, who's this guy? I don't care about him. He's now my rival, apparently. Cool. Um. Oh, they've combined forces. I don't want that. But if I can just wear them down, I think I'll be fine. I feel like I'm missing some enemies here. There should be more. Whatever. Leave those ships behind. I'm gradually winning this war just because they haven't actually done anything else. Once I've recaptured this place, this war score should go down a fair amount. Oh, hello. Oh, no. I need more men. Oh, no. I've lost my bloody... I'm going to lose these mercs now as well. Unless they just... Oh, I got my money back just in time to lose them to wars. Oh, that's bad. Okay, cool. So, um, let's just see if I immediately lose this war as soon as this army's destroyed. 100%. And... There we go. King Hamelin the Liberator of Brittany. Cool. Well... Uh, everything started so well, and now it's not going as well. So, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.